Secretary General of COMESA, Minister Lawi, distinguished guests. It is a great privilege to launch the 50 million African Women Speak platform on behalf of the Republic of Seychelles. As a long-standing member of COMESA, my country, the Seychelles, has had a vibrant and fruitful relationship with a common market for Eastern and Southern Africa Secretariat. Today is yet another example of the results of our strong relationship. Seychelles is one of the smaller countries in COMESA. But our big achievements prove that the contributions of Seychellois women are at the core of our society's transformation. Women are often described as the backbone of our homes and communities and make important contributions to our political, economic, and social advancement. The progress we have made together is the result of government's firm belief in the abilities of Seychellois girls and women. We broke barriers and freed their potential. We accomplished this through the progressive policies that put human development at the center of our agenda. Through legislation and policies, we continue to protect and defend the rights of women to stand together with men without discrimination. The 50 million African Women Speak platform comes at a time when the world needs to come together and work together more than ever before. Following the economic, social, and cultural disruption caused by COVID-19 pandemic, this digital platform provides a one-stop shop for women to access information on how to develop their business and support one another in their own country and others across the African continent. It leverages innovative digital tools to secure livelihoods and economic growth despite the threat posed by COVID-19. In these times of crisis, we need to come together in solidarity. Seychelles is grateful to COMESA and the African Development Bank for this investment. I am convinced that this, in addition to the numerous other programs government is putting in place, will benefit many families and enable them to overcome the challenges they face. I encourage all women to sign in to www.womenconnect.org to do your part to support our families, our economy, and come together for Seychelles. Thank you for listening.